The Royal St. Lucia Police Force wishes to report a relatively incident-free carnival Monday and Tuesday, that is the 18th and 19th of July 2022, leading up to the, the official celebration of the activity, that's the weekend, the police marine unit responded to several incidents over our territorial waters and one individual was arrested for dangerous maneuvering. That individual actually boarded another vessel. He was the captain of one vessel and boarded another vessel without the express consent of the captain of that other vessel. He thereafter stole items from that vessel and has been arrested and will be charged subsequently for the said offenses. Monday and Tuesday saw a very large turnout of police officers with a deployment of 265 regular police officers, 12 RSS members, and 64 special services unit officers. These officers were deployed for various activities, including traffic direction, security of various locations, management of the bands, the parade of the bands, and other security related activities. For the most part, these activities were uneventful with just a few incidents of disorderly conduct. One individual was arrested, however, after he was found in possession of a .380 pistol and three rounds of ammunition. The individual is a 28-year-old male resident of Cedars Castries, and a search of his residence actually had officers recovering additional rounds of ammunition. He is in police custody pending charging. We can also report that over 50 prohibited weapons, and that's inclusive of knives and scissors, were confiscated by officers over the two days of activities. The Commissioner of Police, Milton Daisy, wishes to thank all the officers who turned up for duty over the course of the weekend the night activities, and in particular, Carnival Monday and Tuesday. He also wishes to extend gratitude to the members of the public for their general cooperation through the course of the celebration. Again, thank you. I don't know how to end. <laughs>